What's up, boys? Can we show you guys how to get a shot boost and pretty much never miss any shots? Got a couple of different tips for you guys in this video that'll help you guys make a bunch more shots and uh, hopefully you guys never miss. I know the title's a little exaggerated, but still, you guys are not going to miss very many shots. Uh, before I open this up, if anyone is new, make sure you guys have liked the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications. Those three things would help me out, so I appreciate if you guys would do those three things. Uh, really appreciate the support. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. It's insane because I just started this channel pretty much last month. Uh, so I cannot thank you guys enough, but uh, yeah, let's go ahead and hop into this. Let's go to my career and uh, we have a 91 playmaking shot creator is the build currently uh, We're gonna go ahead. This works for next gen too. I know I'm on current gen currently This is on next gen and current gen uh, what you guys want to do is go ahead and go over to team practice and We're gonna go ahead and mess around with this here. We're gonna take a couple shots uh, Just normally and I'll show you guys what you guys can change to get a boost on your shots and just make overall more shots whether it's in my career my park, just anything. It's going to help you guys out a lot. Um, but let's go ahead and hop into team practice. We're going to take a couple shots here and then show you guys what we can change to help us out here. So let's get a ball here. Uh, if we would stop stretching. There we go. Okay. So we're just going to take a couple shots here. Bang. Yep. So this is just normal shots. You can see the shot meter. Then you guys, if you guys are new to the game or uh, if you guys are uh, used to this game by now, you guys have been playing a couple years you know that if you turn up your shot creator you get your shot meter you get a boost and some people are still don't believe this but i'll show you guys that this actually does work so controller settings and once you guys get here you can turn off the shot meter if you turn off you can turn for three throw shot button pro stick um but we're gonna go shot meter off if you guys do this it's not gonna show your shot meter you guys are want to have your jump shot down for sure but um, it gives you a boost. You're going to make more shots if you guys do end up doing this. So it's easier to green stuff um, with this. I can't believe I haven't green one yet, though. Um, but once you guys get your jump shot down, you're just going to be nailing down shots. As you can see, I don't think we've missed one yet. So probably jinx it. We're probably going to miss this one here. Yeah, as we do. All right. Um, but yeah, so we're going to go ahead and show you guys a screenshot here. And uh, that this actually does work. You can see here, this was in episode 2. There's the little trivia thing. It says, what option can you turn off to get an extra shot boost? 70.6% said shot meter, and that is the correct answer. If you guys get a shot boost, you get an extra shooting boost, they say, if you turn off your shot meter. So this is literally proof that this does work. So this is from 2K. It does work, I promise you guys. We're going to hop into some other things, though, that does uh, that uh, also helps your shooting. So as you can see, we've literally only missed one shot. But you guys are going to want to have your jump shot down for sure. I love my jump shot currently. Um, it's on the channel already. If you guys want to, you guys can scroll through the channel, look for that jump shot. It's a mix of uh, Rudy Gay and Clay Thompson and jump shot 98. So I like it a lot. Um, but let's go ahead and talk about badges now and that what can help you guys out with that. So you guys go to progression, then badges. These are my current shooting badges. I have catch and shoot, dead eye, hot zone hunter, uh, bronze set shooter, sniper, and stop and pop. I love all of these badges so much. They're all really, really good, especially for Park and some of these two for my career. So um, my favorite ones are definitely Catch and Shoot Sniper. Um, the Sniper is very, very good. Uh, the only thing is with Sniper, um, if you guys get an early or a late shot, you guys are going to be screwed. You're going to miss. But if you guys get slightly early or slightly late, you guys have like literally an 80% chance of making the shot. So um, and that's, for, and that's from three points, um, from the three-point line. So those are the badges that I currently like the most. I'm still messing around with some of these. If you guys want to know where your hot zones are for Hot Zone Hunter, uh, you guys all you got to do is go ahead and go to where is it? Play next game, and then if you guys go to where is it? Player stats, I believe, and you guys click um, R3 or whatever it is on Xbox. Show player card and come over here to Hot Zones. This is where all your hot zones are. I have two cold zones, so I'm gonna miss on that area. But uh, from the three-point line, everywhere except for uh, the center is where you're, where I'm gonna pretty much make it, and I'll get that boost for Hot Zone Hunter. I'm gonna be making a lot of shots from the corner, um, from the corners. So, yeah, I mean, Hot Zone Hunter, very, very good. So, as you see, we just greened one finally. Uh, but even from the point, you're really not gonna miss anything either. Yeah, even with Hot Zone Hunter off. So. Uh, we'll probably miss some stuff in the cold zone, though. We'll see. I don't think there's anything negative against cold zones, though. Uh, let's actually check that badge out. I don't think there is. Um, hot zone hunter. So you're taking in hot zones. Yeah, so if you shoot in the cold zone, it's not going to hurt you guys at all. 
Uh, but how to get better hot zones is by literally just going in my career and making shots from there. It's all based on your shot percentages. So if you miss a ton of shots from right here, it's going to go down. I think that shot was off. That actually ended up going in. All right. Um, but yeah, definitely want to, if you guys get your jump shot down, you might want to mess around with this a little bit. Um, I know a lot of tryhards do this, but it actually does help. Uh, keep the shot meter on until you guys get your jump shot down, and then you guys can turn it off, and it will help you guys out a lot if you guys do it this way. So definitely a lot better chance of greening it, even though I've literally only greened one uh, for some reason here. I'll try if I shoot a little later here. Nah, that was, we'll see. Yeah, still can't green one for some reason. But uh, as you can see, we I think we only missed one shot this entire video. So we have taken like 30 as we miss another one. All right, I just keep jinxing, my, jinxing myself, but appreciate you guys watching. That's the video. If anyone is new, make sure you guys, again, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications. Those two things would help me out, and I'll see you guys next time.